After what time is it? Our last question is from Iho, Iha? Kilay uh, girl. Oh. Kilay girl. No, yeah. Kilay girl. Anong, anong pangalan? Justin J.R. Justin J.R. <laughs> Justin J.R. Anong question mo? Uh, Doc, I just want to ask if nakakasira po ba yung magpapa-facial ka ng madalas especially? Katulad ko, gusto kami magpapa-facial pero I never can try. Um, what is uh, too often? Too yeah. Often. Depende sa quality the skin. Like in your case, I think you need one every three weeks lang. Kasi oh, medyo maganda naman. Pag malaki ang pores, pag oily, pag maraming blackheads, whiteheads, actually kailangan kumisan every week, di ba? May mga tao naman, I think minimum once a month in facial. Pero dapat kasi pumunta ka sa isang facial sa may mga doktor para makita nila yung skin mo. Kasi mahirap magbigay ng blanket statement. Hina, tinatanong yun, girls, dahil tayo, madalas tayo mag-makeup talaga. Yes. How often, Lana, do you get facials? Um, I try to go like every two weeks. Before I used to go every week, but then when I see my skin is doing well, every, every two weeks. Two weeks. Yeah. At least once a month. Once a month? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Angelou? Ako means that once a week or pag... Oh, yeah, Angelou, maganda skin mo kasi dahil nagpupuyat ka. And I, pe I feel manipis na manipis yung layer ng foundation yeah. mo ngayon. Yeah, actually yung sa akin, yung pag nafe-feel ko lang na kailangan ko na magpa-facial, yung pag nagtanggal ako ng makeup, Feeling mo madumi pa rin yung face mo. That's when I go to, ano, the part of it. Marjorie? Yeah. I, I try to do it once a week. because Not Ooh. only because of the skin, but for me, it is the best stress reliever. That's so true, no? When you're lying down better there. Than a massage. And, oh. At ang bango-bango, nung yung obaji na nilalagay. Mm -hmm. What do you call the thing? Para oxygen. <laughs> and I like that vitamin C thing Yo, on your face. Ang bango, yeah. ang sarap. Okay, ang kakalilaks yun, di ba? Yeah. Parang one hour peaceful. Ikaw, nagsa-cellphone ka pa rin. Dapat ibaba mo na. Ay, gano'n. Nagsa-facial ka, nagsa-cellphone ka. No, I promise, hindi, o. Hindi, o. Exaggio na yun, o. Hindi naman. Thank you so much to our guests for this morning. Thank you. We're gonna wait to ask them. I'm sure everybody wants to know this. If they wanna see you and consult with you, ano ba yung number na tatawagan, Dr. Joel? Well, you can call at 373-3365 and 373-3365. 3366. taong kausap. Alam mo yung, o oh, ganito, o oh, pwede namang hindi mo nagawin yan, pwede nang ito lang, pwede Friend, gano'n. Friend, magkikay sa atin. Oo, oh, 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 masaya. Yeah. Yeah. Tao siya. Oh, Ang yeah. pag-uusapan natin yun, I'm sure all of you have been wanting to consult with Dr. Joel and Dr. Vicky, pero mm -hmm. feeling nila siya siya <laughs> mahal. We cannot afford mahal well. Mahal talaga. Libre po, mm -hmm. free consultation sa pagbabalik ng Morning, Morning Girl. Girl. my way, pretty woman, say you'll stay with me because I need you. I'll treat you right. For Dr. Abella and Dr. Mendez, can you buy, did you actually have procedures done also on yourself? I have done nothing. You've done nothing? To, to shave my head. <laughs> so you don't, you don't well, need Dr. to take your... Dr. Mendez, you said you don't need to take your... Oh, yeah, you don't need to take them. actually. But in Botox. Oh, Botox. I done. I did it. Oh, I did it. Oh, I did it. Oh, I did it. Oh, I did it. Do na yan. Botox for your forehead? Bakit? Tapos, ano, Dr. Mendez, ano yung sa skin mo? It's called skin whitening. Maybe that all. Ano yun? It's a medication. It's a medication lang. Automatic. Iniinom mo rin yun? Iniinom lang. Gano'n ka dala? O, di ang dami mong ginawa. In diet, pills, Botox. Ayan, bakit? Sabi ko na eh. I did. I did. Okay. Ayan. Dr. Abelo, ikaw naman. Oh, mayroon siya naman. May dami na rin. Your whole body, everything. You did your well, I, I had my eye bags. Okay. I'm sorry, how did you get my eye bags? I bags. Oh. So, I'm yeah. 30 minutes. Oh. Diba? Oh. Alam mo, ang laki ng nga Dati, ang laki ng eye bags mo Ako rin, ang Pero maganda. And that is just through laser. Dr. Vicky, totoo, boobs. 
Boobs, oh, ano may isa nga, diba? Haven't you seen that? Yeah, mas, ano. Wait, you, you, you had it? Gagawa. You had it? No, no, I this, got, is, this is real, and I used to be fatter, like 10 pounds more. It's just here. Because when you lie for your whole body, pa -pa -pa the only yeah. places with, with fat are your boobs and your butt. So the weight will go here and here. But now, I lost weight. I lost all my boobs. Like but even out now. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm debating whether I should or not. But I'm feeling like pop. Like this. Because mm. I used to work in Makati Med and then in radiology, I would see the x-ray. They were 60 years old. Yeah. They were pop a mammography. You can see the implant. Sabi ko, ay lola na ako. Eh, wala na naman ngayon yun, <laughs> di ba? Kaya, baka may nga yung grandchildren ko na ang lola ko may implant. At least para. siya lang lola. <laughs> we have, para po doon sa, kagaya na sinasabi namin earlier, we now have free consultation with Dr. Rabello and Dr. Mendez. Our question number one, Iha, stand up please. Anong pangalan mo? I'm Chub. Short for Chub. Chub. Okay, Chub. Ano ang question mo para sa ating doctors? Um, kasi po, di ba, Huwag mo takpan yung... Yun, okay, Ayan. there. May area talaga na malalaki. Arms, mga bilbel. Pero bakit po, ano, iniisip ko lang bakit, ano, yung puson yung kadalasan na iiwan. Ang hirap-hirap talaga ang palitin. Opo. Ang puson daw, Dr. Labello. Ah, kasi genetics yan. Mga Pilipino talagang puson. Nagko-comment nagko si Margie na for Asian women yes. daw talaga mapuson. Why? Siguro kasi ma-rise rin tayo. Hindi ma-rise rin siya, na. Pilipino lang. Feeling ko. Kasi Short yung mga Thai, yung mga Thai, ang liliit ang mga Chan eh. Diba? Yung mga Spanish, tingnan no? mo, ang liliit ang Chan. Saka we actually, mga babae, mga child-bearing. So, nandito talaga. So, Dr. Joel, pwede bang madaan yan through gamot-gamot? Yung pagkakal, na dapat ilay po na. Yun yung last to go. So, madali lang yun. Last to go. So, pag talagang payat ka na, yun yung pinakamadaling gawin. Ang next uh, question natin, Iha, you stand up naman. Anong name mo? Sally po. Sally. Okay. That Anong girl, Sally. Yes. Ang, um, di ba po kasi common na po sa atin yung nag-undergo sa mga surgery or napaparito ako ito? Bakit po yung iba ayaw po nilang umamin or nag-deny? Lalo na po sa mga atin. Eh, gusto namin i-deny eh. <laughs> Okay, so Nila, si Lana, did it take you a while to be able to make Amen? No, I wasn't scared. I was really excited, actually. I couldn't wait to see it. So when I woke up, I'm like, whoa, it's but, this. But telling <laughs> other people about it, it was okay. You know, well, you know what? It's like this. When somebody asks me if I did it, I admit naman. But I won't go out of the world and say, hey, you, I did my boots. Sino kasama ni Pipa? Our third question is from, what's your name, Ia? Arlene. Arlene, anong question mo? Um, curious lang po ako about diet pills. Di ba marami po ngayon yung naglalabas yung diet pills? Um, nag-work po ba talaga yung mga fat burners and fat absorbers? Dr. Vicky! Yes. Ano ko si Joel yun? Ah, uh, fat absorbers, they just cling on like Senecal or whatever. You just, it goes right so up. So when you use so it, nothing else gets absorbed. So, supposedly it's very safe. The other things, it depends. You know what scares me? I'd, I'd really rather you take pills na alam mo kung anong laman, di ba? Nakakatawat yung Bangkok pills kasi ang daming version. The Bangkok pills doesn't really exist actually. Oh. Kaya lang tinawag mo Bangkok pills kasi it's coming from the Bangkok area. Oh. So when you go there, you don't know where to get it. Iba-iba siya. So iba-iba kung ano yung nag-repa, ano yung magdadala dito. So iba-iba siya. Yung tinatanong kanina, does yung the extra... Yung burners. Pot burners, it doesn't work. Sayang it doesn't pera. work? It doesn't work. Why, Why not? not? Wala. Kasi it doesn't really do anything. You just take it. It's all, all placebo. It doesn't do much. Not ano si Bo means? Means wala. Wala kang hindi, ah, you know. It's like drinking nothing at all. Psychological. Yeah. Skin, like a five-year-old skin. And you can do that now. It's possible na. Kay Dr. Joel, meron ba kasing sumusobra naman yung weight loss na gusto? Kasi di ba? Yeah. They, they have a thing that you can never be too young or too thin. Marami rin cases na gano'n. Marami pa rin. So we, we tell them, oh, tama na yata yan. Makang sobra na. Yeah. Pero kailangan ko kasi sabi niya. And then, so sometimes dinadaya mo na din na. Parang, oh, tama na yan. So... How can you tell kung meron ng problem, uh, problema psychologically kung anorexic na? Well, in the first place, anorexic na yung pagdumating sa'yo. So, you tell, alam na niyo, ah, okay. alam mo na yung history, no? Mm -mm. It means may problem na sa magulang beforehand yun. Or a bulimic. Meron ng problem dati yun. Hindi nakakakause yung medication ng anorexia and bulimia also. Mm -hmm. These are dati pang problema. Na you have to solve also. I'll point it out, like si Beth, kung tutuusin naman, 2 pounds lang pala ang oh, kailangan malusin. Eh. Oo, oh, oo, oh, oo. Oh. Eh, yun lang. Siguro, masyado lang akong nag-freak out na baka tumaba ako ulit. Talagang super takbo ka agad sa wheelie center. <laughs> Do you think, Marshall, I'll ask you that, na 
sa mga Pilipino ba talaga, we set up a false ideal. Kasi kung tutuusin, di ba, dapat i-celebrate natin kung ano talaga yung binigay na skin tone. That's true. Eh, mm -hmm. whatever it is, uh, ge it's genetic. Eh. Mm -hmm. Having good skin and the color of the skin is really genetic. Isa pa yun, I'll bring that up. Yung sa ilong, kasi ang ganda ng ilong ni Miss Margie talaga. But I'm sure, God-given naman yan talaga. A lot of plastic surgeons have told me that I have the perfect nose. Beautiful. <laughs> Di ba? Yeah. Ang ganda ng ilong talaga. So, yun, Dr. Vicky, yung ano, yung pagbabago ng ilong. I think yun ang pinaka-common na cosmetic surgery na ginagawa sa Pilipinas. Yeah. Kasi most Pilipinas, wala talagang bridge. At saka masyadong malapad ang ilong. So, sinitrim, tapos nilalagyan ng konting bridge. Pero, hindi na uso ngayon yung dati na mukhang may stick doon. Di ba? Mukhang halatang... <laughs> ay nagpagawa. Ngayon, konting-konti na nilalagay. Just enough, parang sunglasses naman nila kasi modang-moda rin mag-sunglasses. Hindi naman nandito sa baba, nandito pa rin <laughs> Itako lang natin yun kasi. Na, do you think na, kasi di ba sinasabi nila na ang mga doktor, meron silang Hippocratic Oath, na, di ba? At meron silang mga dapat na tukol sa tunay na health issues lang. Pero pag vanity na ang pinag-uusapan, do you feel that there are certain doctors who would look down on the two of you? Or would criticize you. Well, I know that for sure. I don't think. I know that there are a lot of people. <laughs> I try to be polite about it, di ba? And yeah. of course, because kaying dalawa, you advertise very heavily. And oh. galit sila sa mga doktor na nag-advertise. Ano mo kasi, nag-train ako sa Amerika, di ba? And na-shock talaga ako nung bumalik ako dito. Kasi immediately, may bago ako mga lasers, bagong equipment. Pinalaman ko lang sa tao na may ganun. Ang dami na galit, hindi ko naintindihan. Kasi sa Amerika at saka sa Europa, accepted, basta cosmetic surgery na nag-advertise. Ang hindi nag-advertise yung mga, do you have a heart attack? Then, <laughs> yeah, gano'n. Pero pag mga cosmetic surgery, talaga, 